Number five, how many cups in a quart? So similarly, how many cups are in a quart? So let me, so again, a same measurement kind of question here. How many cups are in a quart? So again, again, we're working in the empirical system and it's also the volume. So don't, we just have to look, look, list our conversion, right? So again, we have one gallon. That was four quarts. We know that one quart equals two pints. And we want to know cups, right? So one pint here equals two cups. It's asking us how many cups are in a quart. So now actually, and we, we actually need to move around this table, right? So I'm, again, I'm going to use this concept of dimensional analysis for us to solve this problem here. So how do we solve this problem? But what we can do is we can look at, okay, how many cups are in a quart, right? We're looking at, okay, so we're going, going to go from quarts here. And we got to go all the way to cups, right? So I can say, um, or actually I can go from cups all the way to quarts, actually. So maybe I'll go the other way here. And I'm going to go, I'm, gonna, I'm starting from quarts, right? So I have one quart here equals, I know, I know it's one quart equals two pints, right? So I'm going to multiply that by, I know that I have two pints in my one quart as, as given in this table here. I have one quart is, I have two pints in a quart. And then I'm going to multiply that again by how many quarts do, how many, how many pints do I have in a quart? Or sorry, how many pints do I have in a cup? Well, I, I know that now I have in, in two cups, I have one pint, right? One pint here equals two cups. And as you can see, my units here cancel out, right? My quarts cancel out, and my pints cancel out here, leaving just cups here. So I can solve this by saying one times two times two. So one times two is two, two times two here is four, right? So this here would give me four cups. And this is the only unit left, right? So now I can say that one, one quart here equals four cups. And this here is our correct answer. Um, and so one quart, quart equals four cups. So they did the exact same thing. We know that one quart here equals two pints and one pint equals two cups. So one quart equals four cups here. So this solution here is correct. Good analysis. Thank <laughs> you.